everyone welcome back my youtube channel salesforce hunt so today i'm going to show you map object in js so if you are new in this channel so please subscribe my youtube channel for more updates and please watch this video until end if you want to learn something new about this map object in js for lwc so let's get started without any further delay so first of all map object in js this is a one and here how to initialize the map so with practical I will show you one by one here so initialize the object so here you can see with the help of new keyword we can initialize the map so how to do that let me show you here so if you are using any kind of you know IDE or any editor or any you know developer tool so you can use it but right now I'm using say Google Chrome developer tool so it's uh, easy to handle it right so let me take it here so now you can see this is the developer tool under this developer tool let me initialize my you know map so it's a const const a costume new map right so once you initialize this map just click uh, enter and now you can see th this undefined something like that right but here you can see once you press or once you enter this a value now you can see the map size is zero and it's having zero items no property something like that right please observe here so once you initialize your map you have to add something inside this map right so how to add it so we can add some elements inside this map and always remember map always work with key value pair right so key always unique value can be duplicate so now here in my example I have this kind of items let's say set is the method to set the key value pair right so let me add this kind of you know items here so a dot set is a predefined method inside this map under this set it's taking two parameters first is key and second is value so let me type here like type is the key and value is car for example purpose so once you type these things now you can see map having one item previously it's a zero now you can see but right now you can see one item and also you can expand it and key and value you can uh, observe or you can read from here as well because it's uh, easy to understand the key value pair inside this map right so let's say I want to add two more items inside this map so you can add like with the help of set method and let's say color black something like that right enter now you can see right now it's a 2 previously it's a 1 and before that you can see 0 initially 0 right now it, you can see two elements inside this map right you can expand it and one by one you can see zeroth position we have this kind of element one position you can see this one right so this is the set method we can add one one more element inside this one so let's say wheels and it's a kind of you know four and now you can see three items right now three two one zero so based on your requirement you can expand it and you can add it here right so once you've done it now you can see this kind of you know maps and elements key value paired right so s basically set you use for adding the value as a key value pair inside your map now you can see getting the element so how to get the element so we can get the element with the help of get method so how to do that let me show you here so now here how to get this kind of values so a dot get is a predefined method based on this method you have to pass the key let's say type and once you enter this one now you can see the based on the key I am getting the value so now type is key and car is value you can get one more element as you want let's say get based on the key let's say color right now it's it's showing like black so immediately you can see this get basically used for getting the values right set for setting the values right so this is the way to getting the value of the map now you can see another method that is called delete the element so how to delete the element let me show you here so under this delete the element 
it's a very simple to understand this one right so let's say uh, I want to delete uh, this uh, type so how to delete it so a dot delete is a predefined matter inside this map and you have to pass the key so my key name is type right so once you define this type like this and after that you can see the response of this delete method is always uh, written true and false as a boolean right so type is already deleted so how to identify my ma map doesn't have this type or not so previously you can see three items right now you will be see two items so how to show that just you have to uh, enter this a value and now immediately you can see two items only color wheels not type because type we already deleted so based on your requirement you can delete it you can add it delete methods now it's time to learn this one that is called clear so if you want to clear all the elements at a time you can clear with the help of clear methods so right now we have two items please observe right so how to clear this map in and also you can check the size as well so let me show you the size of this map so a dot size this is size size is a property and now you can see the size so size is showing like two size here let me zoom zoom it here now you can see the size right and also if you want to clear this map you can clear based on your methods so let's say a dot clear is a predefined method and once you clear it now you can see a and I am trying to print this a still you can see zero size is a refreshed and clear all the elements that's why you can see the zero here right and if you add something you can add it you can remove it based on your requirement now it's time to learn has the element so has a predefined element it's always written boolean value true and false if element is exist is always written as a true otherwise is always written as a false if you didn't see anywhere the element in the map so it's always written as a false if having the elements it's always written as a true right so how to do that let me show you here right now we don't have any kind of you know element inside this one so how to add it add the elements inside this one so let me show you here now you can see our map is clear because we already use the clear method that's why you cannot see any kind of element inside this one so how to add the element inside this one very very easy and uh, this is the second way to add the multiple elements at a time so how to add that let me show you here so in this one here you can see at a time we can initialize the map with the help of you know arrays so how to do that let me show you so under here just you have to use any any kind of you know variables so uh, I'm using like const b equals to new it's a new map under this map right this is the method under here we have to use multiple array type right so under here we have to use like type and key value pair like that right so it's car and second array we have to use like color and this color let's say red and I need another array and this array takes let's say wheels right and here let's say 4 and once you press the enter key you can see here iteration value wheels is not an, an entry object okay because of you know I remove that uh, you know array type so that's why I'm I'm getting this one so let me add that array here and enter now you can see here uh, uncaught error again because I need another you know array and this time is fine now you can see undefined right now just click uh, press the B and you can see we have the three items because it's a map under this three item we have type as a car color is a red and wheels as a four so you can expand it you can see the elements here one by one okay this is the another way to adding the multiple items at a time right so I have another methods size we already done has so how to check this element 
having inside this map or not very easy let's say I want to check this type this key is having the values or not or something like that so just you have to do like b dot has and you have to give your key name so my key name is type so once you give this key name now it's always written as a true and false based on your you know key or without key right so right now type is a key is exist inside this map that's why it's always written as a true but let me do that on other things let's say b dot has under this has let me enter my name so my name is not exist in this map that's why you can see here false value right it's false value here okay so this is the has method now let me move into the another method under this another method let's say I want to iterate with the help of for loop so how to iterate multiple elements at a time with the help of for loop let me show you very easy okay now you have to do one thing like for under this for you have to use another variable let's say i of and then you can give your element as you have so in my case I'm using this b right now and b I need only getting the keys here so how to get the keys at a time we can get with the help of keys method so b dot keys and uh, after that you have to define inside here like console you can print it based on your requirement console dot log right and under this log I want to print this i value right so it's a i right and press the enter key now you can see immediately three items comes here like type color wheels and this is our key that's why I'm using keys me method inside this loop at a time you can get the all keys at a time right so this is the way now I want to get only values so how to get the values very simple instead of this keys you can just replace this values and you can print it now you can see immediately the values like car red and four this is the key right so based on your requirement you can do that right right so now let me move the next method and this method like key value at a time how to print this key value at a time so we can print this key values at a time with the help of like uh, two ways one is entries and without entries method so how to do that let me show you so for now let me add this for loop here for const and this time I want to take two parameter uh, two variables let's say p and q right of let's say b dot entries so this is the predefined method under this loop I want to print under the console dot log this value like p and q so it's a q and just click enter now it's missing something okay it's missing something here okay it's missing here uh, this bracket and just press the, this one now immediately just focus on that one immediately you can see at a time key value pair like type is a key car is value color is key red is a value wheels is key and four is the value right so at a time also you can print like that also you can move into the next method and this next method is having like spread operators so how to get the key keys with the help of spread operator very simple and this is the very faster you know spread operator and it's a ECMAScript 6 ECMA 6 ES6 right features so you can use it so how to do that let me show you like const let me define one variable const double a cost you you can use like um, this spread operator and this spread operator always use this three dots notation and after that you have to use like keys method under this keys method now you can see here I want to print this AA and once you print this AA and uh, it doesn't have any kind of things so let me use another you know variables inside this one because B have the elements so it's a B not blah and after that you can see the uh, output like AA and 
enter here now you can see immediately three items inside this you know uh, keys so now we are getting keys right now I want to get the values as well so how to get the values very simple same you can use it like this instead of this keys you can use values method and just enter and now you can print a a so in the top you can see here just focus that one here you can see the keys and here you can see in the last this is the values at a time so you can get it from here as well right so let me move into the next method and uh, here we already covered lots of methods so this is all about like map objects in JS for LWC so guys I hope you learned something new in this video if you like this video please share like and comments and please subscribe my youtube channel for more updates so till then bye bye take care see ya thank you for watching